Hello and welcome back to Frogboy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew and today we're checking out the 1440p update on the PlayStation 5. I got into the beta. Um, if you look right here, you can see down here we are beta 2.0 on the PlayStation 5. So, uh, let me get this back in here and clipped in. Hopefully it stays that way. All right. So, uh, there's some things that we're going to look at with this today because we have, what we have here is, um, okay, right here, what I was playing was the uh, um, uh, Sackboy. This game is freaking incredible, man. If you haven't picked this up on your PlayStation 5, this is the one. Uh, the reason why I picked Sackboy is because this game is native 1440p, so I wanted to be able to have that represent, you know, like the, the baseline 1440p in this test. This game looks pixel freaking perfect on here. Like this, this looks incredible. Now this game already looked incredible on a 4K OLED, but this literally looks pixel freaking perfect now. Like this is literally perfect. The uh, um, the materials look great. I mean, like this rug, the rug that I'm walking on, like the carpet, it looks freaking phenomenal. The um, uh, when, when you, ooh, yeah. Oh, there we go. Look what I found. I found a secret plate that flies over to me. So that is cool. So, um, like this other level that I was on for the other video that I was making, I, I was making another video on this before I, um, before it got, um, before it, uh, b before I found out that I had no sound on there. So now we had to, I had to redo, I had to redo the video. So now we're doing it again with a different camera and microphone. Um, so th yeah, this, this looks literally incredible now. Like this is so freaking good. The leather material that I was on, it, 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 oh gosh, it just, it looks so freaking nice. Uh, whoa, look at this ninja dude. He wants to fight. Boom. Get out of here, buddy. Oh yeah. Let's get over here and. Oh, wait, uh, is it this button? This button right here. <laughs> you don't even want to know. You don't even want to know. Like that, that, yeah, that's in a kid's game. That's in a kid's game. That's, I mean, this is technically a kid's game. Eh, hoy. Yeah, I'll get in your mouth. I will, I will. Let me just collect all my goodies. I got goodies to get. Boom, boom. Ah, oh, look at this. Another goodie room. Yeah, we're going to go in over here and we're going to collect all this stuff first. And then I'll jump in there. Ooh. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, we definitely want to check this out. Oh, my gosh. Let's get over here and get this guy. Boing. Bam. That looked like he wanted to run away. Yay, I get stuff. Oh, I jump on you again. Ah, I get stuff. I got stuff. Oh, yeah. See, this This is pretty cool, man. Like, this, this looks so incredible now on this. Um, okay, so now we're going to go ahead and we're going to check out a different game. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and get right out of this one. Um, I know, I know. We'll get back around to that. Me and Junior play that. We, we we sit down every once in a while, and then we play that game, and we just have some fun. So that one's 1440p, and also Demon Souls has a 1440p mode. Like, this looks incredible on the screen. Um, I am using a, um, a 1440p LG Ultra Gear. Uh, it's got 165 hertz refresh rate. It is a... 100% like th this is an awesome monitor. I really love it. Um, I have another bigger one that I hook up to my to my PC uh, We're gonna go ahead and jump into this real quick Like this is really 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 good All right 
All right, now this right here is freaking incredible now. So I get to play this the way I wanted to play it from the very beginning. Now that we have 1440p support, I get to play this game at pixel perfect freaking resolution at 60 frames a second. And that is so nice, so nice. This looks so much better now. You can look out, down, over, everywhere. Ooh, a piece of candy boy. Oh yeah. Like this, this is so great, so great. So yeah, you can laugh at me all you want. Man, I've beaten the first boss and then that's about it. I tried really, really hard to get over my, my, uh, lack of 4k it's I, I really tried in a 4k but it was just too too stuttery for me uh, but this is literally perfect now can definitely play this so I will be running through this game again uh, I will be going through this game um, probably probably pretty shortly probably why I'm testing this this um this update so all right we're gonna get out of there that looks incredible with the 1440p mode now now the biggest thing we want to see is how well does it downsample from 4K to 1440p? Does it add any more visual clarity or visual to the visuals to the game? Now Gran Turismo is native 14 or is native 4K at 60 frames a second. So this game should automatically scale down to fit the 1440p resolution, which in turn should give you better visuals, right? It should in turn give you better visuals. For the most part, like from what I can see right now, it, it does do that. Like this does look a lot cleaner. Um, the dashboard looks nicer, sharper, crisper with the... Uh, with more uh, texture, more texture look. It has more of a textured look in it now. Um, some of the other things, like on the ground, the other cars, they look, they look really nice still. Uh, the fence, when you drive by these fences, they look a lot better. You could see more stuff, more dirt and dust and debris, and like the little rubber chunks when the cars all go around them. Like you, it, it feels like it, it feels like it has better atmosphere to those. Like you can see them better. Whoa, buddy! Driving still is a is one of those hard things for some people to do. No, I'm just joking. But yeah, this does look like it is in fact going to be able to super sample um, 4K games down to 1440p, therefore giving you a little bit better. Um, a little bit better visuals um, overall. Overall, it does look nicer. It, it looks sharper. It looks a little bit cleaner and a little bit crisper. Uh, 1440p is pretty much the sweet spot for PlayStation 5, I believe. Um, I'm really hoping that this will encourage Sony and Sony first-party developers to really uh, to really go for a um, to really go for the uh, uh, 1440p with high settings and you know higher frame rate and stuff. I really hope that this update will encourage them to to shoot for that type of a mode as well for the uh, for the people that would like to play these on a 1440p monitor because this is great. This system is perfect for 1440p, like literally perfect. And this looks great, man. This looks great on this um, with the uh, with the 1440p. So. Oh boy! All right, so I am gonna go ahead and stop that, and then kind of bring you over here and let you look at this again. Uh, like I said, this is oh dang. Uh, let's see, middle button, go to home. So this is beta 2.0. Let me go ahead and show you in the. Uh, oh come on, get over there settings again with that uh, screen and video now you do you will have a 
resolution of 2160p, 1440p, 1080p, and then you can also set that to automatic. But I, I was when I was doing the testing on the other video, I noticed that the, um, um, I noticed that if you, because I had it plugged into my 4K OLED at first, and then I uh, switched it over to the monitor, and when I switched it back over to the monitor, it automatically set the resolution stuff back into back into uh, automatic. So, and then I wasn't getting the, uh, I was not getting the, um, the super sample down on Gran Turismo. I wasn't getting the, any, any of those other visual, um, any of those visual things, but, oh, you know what? There is one more game we can look at now. See this, this freaking update, Uncharted, Uncharted is supposed to give you 1440p. This has a 1440p mode, and then I believe godfall does as well so i will let you look at this one here just for a second a thieves end was the last one i was playing story but let's go into options go down to display oh no yeah, that's going to take us to the 120 hertz so we want the uh performance mode okay this one here yeah all right this is the one we want so let's go up here to story and continue that. It's a good thing I decided to get this. Okay. Oh, wow. See, this This update's literally perfect for people that want to be able to play these games with native resolution and still have solid frame rate. Yeah, this looks perfect. This looks perfect. Literally perfect. It looks like you are. So here's the thing with 1440p and these higher settings, like you literally can see this this is pixel freaking perfect like literally pixel freaking perfect on a 1440p monitor this is this is why this channel has kind of changed a little bit its view on like the whole 4K and blah 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 because everything i play on my on my series x on this 1440p monitor automatically super samples down to 1440p and so now you finally get like this pixel perfect clarity literally everywhere. And it's uh it's it's perfect. So if you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. I will be doing some more videos on this. This is this is amazing. Like the clarity that you get now is freaking incredible. So I hope um, I'll. Well, I, I I would put a just. I'll I'll put a I'll put a. Um, no, I was gonna put a link in the description for this monitor, but I think any 1440p monitor should suffice. Just you can usually get a good deal on them. Um, I got this one for like 400 bucks. Um, that's a pretty good price for all the stuff you can get. I'm pretty sure that Sony will start supporting VRR on the 1440p. I, I, I don't see why they wouldn't. That that just would not make any sense. But gosh, look at the cracks. Oh my gosh, this is so incredible. So, all right. If you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.